Hey guys, welcome back to another extra video. In this video, I would love to do a tutorial on how to put custom sky uh, images on your new map when it comes to creating a new map and if you want to, you know, put custom skies in it and whatever. So, uh, what you'll need to do first off before you do any editing and whatnot is you'll need to download a program called S XWE, also known as Extended WAD Editor. And in order to open, and I'll leave the uh, link to the download site in the description. And in order to open the program properly without any errors, you'll need to right click um, and then run as administrator. And yes. And as you can see right here, I already have my map loaded. And I will explain, you know, the details. And what, you know, if you're creating a map from scratch, what you'll first need to do is when you load your map onto XWE, you'll first need to add the PP start, which is right here. Um, what you'll need to do is go to entry and then uh, new. And then just type in the PP start, and then um, you don't have to worry about the, the entry number or whatnot. Because once you type in PP start, it'll automatically give it the, the um, marker number. So I'll cancel out that, and then uh, well, <laughs> I think it. Anyways, um, and then make sure you put a PP end there too, so that way, you know, you know, your patch or whatnot will be in it. So, what you're going to need to do is, uh, first, um, the way I have on mine is, I have it set to map 1, and it's very rele rele relevantly different if you're doing your map on Doom, or if you're doing your map on you know, Doom 2, and so what you're going to need to do is click on PP Start, which I just did, and then click Patches, and notice on how there's nothing in it, because of course, you know, you don't have it, this is basically for the, um, uh, uh, map, the textures that you did yourself, or however you want to say it, and then what you're going to need to do is double click, on patches, and uh, and I'm gonna actually scroll down to one that I actually took, which is this one. And this is an actual photo that I took of my took myself. And you're gonna need to open it. And so, and as you can see, it's you know layer and it, depending on uh, how many pixels. You know, and one thing you're going to want to do is, in order to get the picture to look like this, is you're going to want to either open Photoshop or Paint or whatnot. And then what you need to do is, now quickly, so I to do right now, quick. So down here, and now you right click on Edit. And what you're going to need to do is, um, well, this one's already edited, but, um, you need to click resize, and then make sure you click pixels, and then type in for horizontal 256 and vertical 128. And make sure when you do that, depending on the editor you use, like right now, I'm using this paint, uh, make sure you unclick maintain aspect ratio or whatnot. Cancel on layer. And then what you're also going to need to do is you're going to need to rename the past name in order to um, make, you know, make it be in the map. So what you're going to want to do is um, rename entry and then put um, uh, Sky 1. And depending on what stages are doing your map, like if you're doing a map on Doom, 
um, got my seeing the, that the sky textures in Doom changes pretty much every level. And, um, like, for example, if you were doing a, uh, level from, uh, well, yeah. If you're doing a level from, for, for the f first level, of if you're doing a level for the first episode, you know, for Sky 1, uh, so on and so on for the other, so for the other two, but for, since we're doing a level for Do Z, for Doom 2, um, you're gonna put one for our sky one, cause, you know, it'll be the first map. And we, then we put okay, and, you know, and then, go to all, and then to make sure that it's in there, you're gonna wanna, you know, look in between the PP start, uh, and then in PP end, and there is the our sky one. And then, in order to put it in your map, you're gonna want to close. And, uh, I'm gonna pause right here, and I'll, I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like via Doom Builder and the map. So, I'll see you guys in a minute. Hey guys, uh, I'm back here. Um, now, so, um, now that we have the map loaded onto Doom Builder, um, I'm gonna show you guys the sky te texture that I just inserted in this map. I mean, there's nothing to the map, just, you know, but, uh, first I'd like to show, the sky may be the same from, you know, what we just inserted, but, um, since it is kind of the default, you know, it's gonna have the same default thing, but I'm gonna go ahead and test the map just to show you what it'll, it'll look like. Alright, now, as you can see here, it's not, it's, kind of seated, but you'll get the idea on, you know, but, um, you have nice, well, not really nice, sky layout here, and, uh, you know, it's pretty cool and simple. So anyways, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed my little tutorial video. Feel free to check out my other videos, and also feel free to comment, like, and or subscribe to my videos. Uh, subscribe to my channel. All in all, this is Doom Mastermind 1985 saying thank you and keep on doing.